Welcome to the standard operating procedure for the VSP pump, your guide to using this powerful and versatile pump with ease and efficiency. Whether you need to install modes for different installation scenarios or adjust the pump shutoff or desired pressure to meet your specific requirements, this procedure will walk you through the steps to get the most out of your VSP pump. To select different modes, simply push the mode button. The first mode is up. Select this mode when the pump is installed lower than the highest point of water demand, such as when the pump is located at ground level and water needs to be supplied to a tap or geyser higher than the pump. The second mode is down. Select this mode when the pump is installed higher than the highest point of water demand, such as when the pump is located on top of a building and supplies water down into the building. The third mode is time. Select this mode when the pump will not be used for extended periods of time, such as when the pump is installed at a holiday home that is only used occasionally throughout the year. By repeatedly pushing the time button, you can change the time delay between the pump idle times. Now let's learn how to adjust the pump shutoff or desired pressure. Use the plus or minus button to increase or decrease the target pressure. Please note that the maximum pressure for the 0.75 kW pump is 4.5 bar and for the 1.5 kW pump is 6 bar. The best efficiency range for the 0.75 kW pump is between 2 to 3.5 bar and for the 1.5 kW pump is between 2 to 5 bar. You can adjust the pressure while the pump is in operation to suit your specific needs. And that's it. Now you know how to select different modes and adjust the pump shutoff or desired pressure using the VSP pump control panel.